That one is uh, barley and uh, like red bean mm -hmm. with coconut. I don't know. What do you want? Cheers. <laughs> mm. Mm. All right. Prefer the other one. I prefer the other one too. Friday night. Friday night. Let's see. We got some Thai tea. Kareem did some cooking already, so he cooked for the kids. Let's see what Kenton bought. Kids, yeah, no kids. What's that? Flan. Flan. Oh my God, that's a cute little flan. Look at that. But you see, this is the size we're supposed to be eating. Americans were so used to everything being super sized. <laughs> this is the Vietnamese flan. It's not Vietnamese. It's, it's just, not Vietnamese. No. So why was it sold at a Vietnamese place? Because people like flan. So okay. They sell what they like. All right. Wait, isn't that that grass drink that didn't go so well the last time? Yeah, well, you try, try again. <laughs> What's in it again? Oh, just a bunch it, of stuff. Barley, uh, uh, like um, lychee, and you got uh, uh, nuts. Yeah, I didn't mind it growing uh, when we were younger, Agar. but this last time it hasn't been good. Well, it's, it's we'll see. Good. And this is, um, this is bean, and a little more barley, and uh, coconut. Hey, honey, you really do look like you've lost weight here. Mm -hmm. People have been saying you've lost weight, but I didn't believe that you look like you lost weight because I see you every day, but you do look thinner. Mm -hmm. Nice. So. All right, so that had coconut milk in it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. What's this one? Corn. Oh, my God. What's up with coconut. these desserts? <laughs> all right, guys, we all have to try new things. New things. <laughs> yeah. New things, all right. And then, and then I love Vietnamese food. I just don't know that they are very good when it comes to dessert, in my opinion. Well, in my is, humble opinion. It's, it's different. It's different. <laughs> yeah. <That's all. laughs> you know. Even after over 20 years plus of marriage. Well, again, you know, uh, so this is uh, your. Mm, okay, that looks good. So that's yours. That's mine. The mm -hmm. egg rolls, the meat, egg and the little meat. greens, and mm -hmm. the sauce. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Delicious. Delicious. Spicy uh, noodle soup. Okay. Yeah, you know. mm -hmm. That's the one that comes with the bread? Uh, no, well, I, I, have, I have the banh mi with it. You know, the uh, Vietnamese uh, sandwich. Oh, okay. Yep. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That's it. All right, what's in here? Oh, that goes with the soup. Let me see. So the kids told us to go away. They were going to get their own food. Okay, interesting. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Yeah. Tell them. Yeah, I'm so hungry. Mm. I'm so hungry. Wow. This is what Kareem cooked. Wow. Let's see. Nice. It's in the oven. Ooh, we got some roasted potatoes. They look good, Kareem. Nice. So he warmed up the, would you say it's called a broth? Well, yeah, it's a spicy beef broth. Mm -hmm. It's got lemongrass in it. Mm -hmm. See, so they have chunks of lemongrass. So yeah, he reheated it. You can see the smoke from it. Because it needs to be super hot in order to kind of cook the uh, meat, the thinly yeah, cut meat. Cut meat, yeah. See, so you can see the steam coming out of it. Actually, those are already cooked, right? Yeah, those are cooked. Yeah, this is but nice. that one isn't. Yeah. So it's got to be like really fresh, thinly, thinly cut pieces of meat so that it actually cooks in the broth. Oh. Kind of like they do with the hot pots, right? Right. It's like a, exactly. What you're doing is like a hot pot. 
So my apologies to all our vegetarian <laughs> viewers. So I know this might be difficult, so I apologize. What's that? That looks like cow foot or something. Yeah, they throw, I didn't ask for this. You didn't ask for that? That oh looks like God. some sort of cow well, foot. I don't know, just. Or oxtail or maybe, something. Maybe it's for. Maybe it's for what? Flavor. <laughs> There's even. What's that? Like blood, blood pudding. Blood pudding? Interesting. Yeah, yeah it's, a, it's a different kind of meal. <laughs> you might want some of those uh, potatoes and things yeah. too that Kareem yeah. made. Mm, I don't know. No, you're, you're comfortable with this. Oh, well, yeah, no, I'm comfortable with it. I just, you know, it's, uh, it's a little different. And of course, if you want it even more spicy. Mm -hmm. so, but what they've added Ooh, though. That looks hot. This is shrimp paste. A shrimp paste? Yeah, mm -hmm. so it's a very pungent. Mm. Yeah, if you want to smell it. No, I take your word for you it. Smell it. Oof. Ooh. <laughs> I don't know, it might clean me out tonight. <laughs> that is a meal. Yep. First meal of the day, actually. How's it taste? Spicy. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But good, very good. Meanwhile, I am demolishing my food. All right, y'all, we're gonna try these desserts, Kareem and I, because we've never had, well, I've had this one many, many years one. ago, and you've had this one, right? I've never had this one. This is what? Just corn. Corn. And coconut. And coconut milk, and this one's got like some kind of beans and coconut milk. Oh, All right, Kareem, let's see which one you're gonna try. Oh, yeah. That one is uh, barley and uh, like red bean mm -hmm. with coconut. All right, you want to do it one, the same? We'll try the both yeah, at the you gotta same do it time. Yeah, you got to do one Okay. Oh, I was going to put some separately. Yeah, so... You don't feel like I wasted it. Yeah, it's so also uh, for our viewers, they can actually, like, see the consistency. And... It's like a pudding... Yeah. ...with black-eyed peas in it. <laughs> Which, like I say, is a strange thing to think of as dessert. Yeah. I don't okay. know beans, but try it. It's not bad. It's not bad. Mm -hmm. I like red beans. Right? Want... It's not red beans though, right? Isn't it black eyed peas? Oh, it's black eyed peas, oh, it yeah. Mm -hmm. It tastes like it. It's not bad. What you taste mostly is the sweetness and the coconut milk. Should I show your face? Mm -hmm. It's fine to show my face. <laughs> I look tired though, right? Yeah. Well, you had a long day. All right, not bad. So I think even if you weren't accustomed to a dessert like this, this is, it tastes also kind of healthy. Does it taste healthy? Mm. <laughs> it's not as sweet as American desserts. What do you think? No, I think it's sweet enough. It's just the um, beans flavor. It's different. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. Let's try this one, Kareem. So that's just corn. Mm -hmm. But it's corn with coconut. All right, I'll just have this little bit. Yeah. Because I'm already getting full from all that food. Yeah. Okay. Cheers. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> Mm. Mm. All right. Prefer the other one. I prefer the other one too. A different. What kind of dessert? It's a little bit salty. Yeah, it's a little, a little it's salty. It's like a yeah. salty, no, they, right? They, they add salt to it. Yeah. No, my American palate. It does not compute in my brain. Hmm. Yeah, it's a little too salty. <laughs> Is it? It's like salty coconut with the kernels of corn. I mean, I don't really taste corn too much. Really? 
I think it's just the the saltiness is throwing me off. So it's a no for me. Yeah, okay. You need a clean spoon? You need a clean palate. <laughs> <laughs> clean palate. Go ahead, serve up. Uh, is this more of a drink? Uh, well, no, it's it's not a, it's a no, it's a, not a, a drink. It just has, you know... Um, All kinds of stuff in there. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah, it's, it's got a, like some sort of plum... Yeah, so you got, uh, yeah, it's like preserved seaweed. plum. You got, it's, it's more like agar. It's not really seaweed, but it's... The green stuff? Yeah, so, you know, that's like jelly. You know, uh, I think that's jelly. definitely more than enough. Yeah, barley. I like the, the juice part. I remember this tastes kind of like burnt sugar. Right, yep. It's, right. It's like sugar. So I feel like <laughs> Kareem, I can see you. He's trying to put back his stuff in the other bowl. All right, do you want this clean? No? Okay, let me try this. Okay, y'all. Okay, Man, don't be so dramatic. <laughs> I'm not Lord. being dramatic. Okay, After that last one, okay, y'all. <laughs> it's like lychee in there, yeah. so it's not bad. Mm. It's just what throws me off is the taste of the seaweed in there. Mm. Not really a fan, but yeah, it tastes the fish. juice, right? If the seaweed gives it like a fishy ish, well, it's a taste. grass jelly, too. Is in there. No, I don't, no. I don't remember this. <laughs> you don't remember it. Like you got hit in the head or something. You don't remember. No. In the right? You don't remember it? You used to be when you were little, you're like, Daddy, Daddy, grass jelly, grass jelly for my belly. Well, you don't remember saying that? Nope. No, I don't remember either. Nope. What's this? <laughs> this stuff. Huh? What's, what's this? Uh, probably some fungus. Who knows? Fungus? Okay. Let's try it. It's just like a a weird texture. It's like a like tripe texture. Mm -hmm. yeah, right? But it's not tripe. It better not be tripe. No, it's not tripe. Oh, you agree? So many things going on. Yeah, it's a lot, so many right? Things going on. It is a lot. <laughs> Daddy, you want this plum? So that people see, there is a lot going on. I don't it's know. It's a lot I, going on. Yeah, there's a lot in there. Um. Okay. It's just all texture and only fish. It's like texture, right? Mm. And fishy. Yeah, this, this one's enough. That's a no too. I'm telling you, I told you, Vietnamese do not do dessert very well. I'm sorry. Yeah, this one is pretty good. The first one is not the bad. The bean, yeah, right. the bean. And their flan better taste like flan. It's, you know not, our, it's cultures, not our flan, though. Yeah. Some yeah. cultures, they it's like not, say not, they're doing stuff they and do then flan. it's different. We don't do flan. So that's not Vietnamese? Of course no. not. Okay. Then hopefully it's good. No disrespect, you guys, but... All right, Kareem, you want to try this plan together? <laughs> no, you're out. He's, he's out. He's tapped out. He tapped out, man. <laughs> he tapped out. <laughs> okay, let's see. Okay, let's see. <laughs> it tastes like flan. It's not very sweet. It's not as sweet as what I would... So I think Vietnamese well, people made this. The, 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 the sugar's on the bottom, the, car uh, the caramel. No, but even... Yeah, so if you mix it, it on yeah. The right, it's at the bottom. That's, a, that's, that's where okay, the sugar is. Okay, let me see. Yeah. See, yeah, that's that dark caramel. So if you try that. It's a little bitter. You know, I know it's burnt sugar, so it should be bitter, but... I'm going to try it, Kareem. It's just not quite right, not my usual flan. It's alright. It's alright, huh? Yeah, it's just it's not as sweet as you probably used to, but it's alright. It's like a cut, yeah, it's, a, a, it's, 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 it's just a, a custard, but not Alrighty, as sweet. Alrighty, so that was that. So we tried it. Two out of four? Two out of four? No, one out of four. Not even a flan? No, the flan gets a five out of ten. This flan is not it. It's a five out of ten. Okay. This this one is like maybe a nine out of ten, yeah, right? This is a nine right. out of ten. Oh, okay. This is the beans and the coconut custard. Yeah. This was good. Mm. The corn, negative. Is it like a four? 
<laughs> like I'd eat it if I had to, but yeah, that's that's uh, I wouldn't prefer. It. That's like uh. And then what about this one? Survival food. Yeah, that one. I, I'd probably just. I don't know if I'd even drink it, but maybe <laughs> a two, a two. A two. Wow. You'd rather starve. <laughs> okay. It's as if it's, it's it's so fishy. I like dessert. Right. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Not by American maybe, or Western standards. I feel like standards. maybe if it was warmed up, maybe it'd be like no, a, no, 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 no. That would be no. gross. Like a no. fishy no. drink no. with like a broth. Mm, the same soup. As dessert. I don't know. Not no as dessert. I'm just saying maybe as like a, I don't know a meal, not a dessert. Mm -mm. Yeah, maybe it worked better. But I think meal, your right? father might probably like that. All right. <laughs> a salty, huh? No, I like it. It's you like weird. that? No, it's okay, but it's no, a that's what I'm salty. saying. It's like it's it's very familiar to me. That's why I'm like. Mm. You've had that. You've oh. had all of this. Mm hmm. Right. You have. Ow. It tastes fine to me. I didn't say it tastes bad. It's just not. Good. You gave it a two. Not that one. Where did you I get? It was like a four or five. Oh, this one you gave this a, one two. Was a two. This was like one of my favorites when I was a kid. No wonder what. <laughs> what, what. Go ahead, say it to your grandma in California. You know, wonder what. I'll tell you. What? I'll say it what, off boy? Camera. What? <laughs> yeah, that's so silly. <laughs> say it off camera. What are you going to say off camera? What? You were talking about your childhood. Right. <laughs> childhood. childhood was very interesting. I love you, Mom. <laughs> yeah. <All right. laughs> Son number one came down. He's gonna try it. No, you gotta put more than that. Put some of the um. But I don't think put you're some supposed of to the. Really yeah, that. you're supposed to. Wait, it's decoration. It's not decoration. It's, it's like tea bags. You're not supposed to eat the tea bag. No, that's actually part of it. Daddy says you're supposed to eat all of it. Okay. okay. So go ahead. I don't even know what it is. Right? Aren't you half Vietnamese or quarter no, Vietnamese? No. That's not how it works. There's no math with it. It's not good. <laughs> it's not good? <laughs> but you took it like it was good. <laughs> I'm not trying to be disrespectful. I just don't like it. What about the seaweed? Wait, did you try the seaweed? It's seaweed, but it's, I, don't, I don't like nuts. So, whatever that is. It's like barley or other, I don't know. All right, the other one you probably will like. Go ahead. You don't like that one either? <laughs> That's the one we all agreed looks tasted good. That's the beans and the coconut. You didn't like that? <laughs> Rinse out with that Thai tea. That Thai tea is fine. Yes. Yeah, the Thai tea is fine. Okay. What about the flan? I don't like. I don't like one the flan. You don't like it's flan? Serious. I like it, but it's too small. No, I don't want any more. You can have like it. it. Yeah, I don't know where the corn one went. So I assume Daddy ate it because I don't see it. There was another one. So you don't want any more? <laughs> Good morning, everybody. Good morning. I just wanted to come up here and say I apologize for looking so bad yesterday. I had food all over my shirt. I don't know how Kenson had had me filmed that way. I was looking jacked up, honey. <laughs> I had like sauce all over my shirt, but hopefully you guys understand. Anyway, this is a fresh face. It's Saturday and we're going out to get some pumpkins and mums. We actually have a few, but I needed a abundant look. So we're getting some more. <laughs> uh, what else? We already have fairy lights. Um, hopefully by the time you watch this video or vlog, I've already put up a fall deck or fall porch decorating video. So I hope you've watched it. Kind of get you in the vibe. What else? Um, oh, Boy. make sure by the time, well, you know, I don't know, by the time they watch this, maybe voting has already... Vote. Doesn't matter what party you are in, well, it does for me, but I'm mm -hmm. with being not biased or right. preferential, uh -huh. but voting, exercise your rights to vote. October 9th, 
registration deadline in most areas and states. Make sure you got your address correct. Right, because like yeah. us, we've moved a couple of times, you know that. So uh, this is how they get you. You can't vote if your yeah. uh, address doesn't or, match. Or the system could also inadvertently make you inactive. Mm -hmm. So even if you had voted, mm -hmm. but maybe you didn't vote in a, in a local election, double check. Go to your local, uh, uh, what is it, uh, dot .gov. Uh, local election boards mm. and so forth. See, I look all messed up too. <laughs> no, you don't. Right. You, to, you know what it is? Yeah. Your t-shirt looks all like... <laughs> it's so extra. It's so extra. But vote October 9th. <laughs> Come on, this is serious. You, yeah. You know no, seriously. Remember, Obama says... They may not be Obama supporters. It doesn't matter. It's in the news. It's not about being a supporter. It's just saying... Okay, what did Obama say? Sorry. Elections matter elections have results they okay? do and, and then so, when people sit out and say oh we so know more, who's gonna win we're not even gonna bother it's, it's no more about the you presidency. have decided it's about the legislature right it's about it's about the supreme court it's like you know everyone gets focused only on one person mm -hmm. it's about the whole thing it's right. totality everyone your prosecutors your judges oh, you know i don't like a little bit of this i don't like a little bit of that. you know really what it comes down to is what is the value of that person it's values because values leads if you don't have values you're all over the place mm -hmm. okay if someone doesn't tell you the truth honestly is that how you live your life do you want to trust someone or work for someone that doesn't tell the truth and is not honest and then they get then you see the results that comes from it come on now Okay, this is time for us to wake up. Hmm. That's the thing. So your vote, it does matter. Honestly, I mean, if we if we came to you and we told you a, a bunch of lies in regards to anything, would, would you watch us? Would you even care what we said? No, we're not. It matters. We take seriously. Do we teach our children that it's okay to lie, steal, and cheat? You know, to be disrespectful to other people? No, mm -hmm. we don't. But then why would we want someone as our leader to be the same way, to have no compassion, to not understand, to know right. what it's like to work and, and toil, and raise a family, or even be a single parent, you know, or care for someone that has an illness, an elderly parent, or even a child that has a, 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 who's differently able or challenged. Why did he tell you he doesn't care about those people? Man, he wants to take away pre-existing conditions. He wants to take away the things that are lifelines like Obamacare. You know, if people wouldn't have uh, services if it wasn't even around for it. It's not a perfect law, mm -hmm. but that's the whole point. That's where the legislature has to step up and work hard mm -hmm. about it. So what would you say to like, you know, See, for you I know. What would you say, for morning. example, those the uh, like even family members, you know, that By, are not democratic. Not Democrat. Yeah. Well, I respect their opinion mm -hmm. in the sense that they have a right to their opinion. I, right. I have my own opinion. I love them. They're my family, and so I love them. They have a difference of opinion. opinion. Right. But what do you think is their main reason for sticking? to the other side. It's always economics. It's, all, right. it's always about the money, you know, mm -hmm. for the most part. Well, for my parents, it's more about he's anti-communist. That's it. They're one, they're kind of one issue voters. Mm -hmm. and, they're, they're, and they're out there, they're just like anti-abortion. As long as you're anti-abortion, I don't care about everything else. But see, the thing is, is that if you but can't feed your family... That's focused on one it, main When you want an issue, it's like you're anti-abortion. issue, but right. First, I have mixed feelings about abortions too. I don't right. think it's the best, it's, it's the best option in many situations. But you know what? It's a woman's right, though. Right. See, that's the thing. It's like, especially as I'm studying the law, a lot of our law have, put, have made women, really, honestly, mm. as property. It's amazing. When you start studying the history of our legal system, right. women have been property to men. They didn't even have rights of ownership. They didn't have rights to vote. Mm. They didn't have rights even of inheritance, for most part. Right. It's, it's only hard. recent that so, they were allowed to vote. Exactly. Crazy. And so it's like, we, we, we have this... We have this amnesia that you have to fight for these rights. But then once you get them, you just you take them as, oh, it's always like that. It's not. And there's always people out there that wrote. And then, then the last thing I'm going to say, before I wish everyone a happy fall, <laughs> is that really listen to the words. Because words matter. And when you can't stand up to racism, when you just play around and you can't just say deny it, how hard is it to deny it? It doesn't take anything to say, no, I disagree. Mm -hmm. But when you can't say it, that's enough. It's the end of story. Just stop playing around. Go out there and vote. Okay, early voting is going to start uh, on the 15th for, for many jurisdictions that allow it. Do it. If you want to mail in the ballot, mail in your ballot, then check to make sure they have, they have registered your vote.
Okay, yeah. you do your due diligence, but you got to take this seriously and then get other people to vote and keep talking to people because change happens and I, and I believe it, it does happen. You have to do it. Okay, anyways, right. happy fall. <laughs> happy fall, happy fall on that note. <laughs> Bye. So I'm at my front door and uh, these are my feet. You can see this is what we do. Okay, so you know that it's not a magazine or someone's fake picture. Isn't that pretty? Yeah, this is uh, a kind of cool picture you can do on Instagram or anywhere really. Just take your front door mat, put some pumpkins and flowers and you've got a nice picture. Right? Kenton just came back from his evening test. He had a test at night actually. His law school is tired. But he brought back a cupcake. Apparently they gave him cupcakes um, after the exam. <laughs> so let's see. He said he didn't think he would want it, so he's giving it to me. It says Gigi's Cupcakes. So I've never heard of them before. It was all my sweet tooths. Y'all know you want to see, right? Ooh, so cute. So cute. You said they said it was um, not vegan, but gluten free. No, it's not. It's regular. Oh, this one's regular. Yeah, they had a gluten free option. Oh, they had a gluten free option, but he didn't want it. <laughs> How perfect does this cupcake look? How perfect! Mm, we are going to tear this up. 